All right, now let's get nuts. I just reviewed the D-Train. Screw that. Screw, screw the D-Train. Get that out of here. Get that Jack Black shit out of here. Now we are going to talk about, I, I'm pretty sure, the final trailer for one of my most anticipated films of this year. That's right, Mad Max Fury Road. This is... They, they call this one the official main trailer, so I guess this is, like, yeah, the the real one. The other two, screw them, this is the real one. And I am really excited for this film, so let's get straight into it. Boom! Alright. Ooh, starting right off with the action, nice. In this wasteland, I am the one who runs from both the living and the dead. Alright, long Mad Max. Oh no. Yeah, you jump for that. Alright. Oh, spill. Oh shit. All we've seen Mad Max do. I'm sorry, I, I, I'm sorry, I'm enthralled. I'll, I'll say it after the trailer. Whoa. I want them back! They're my property! Okay, so it has to do with the girls. I'm so excited to see him in the movie. Nicholas Holt. I heard he's awesome. Like, early screenings. Ooh. That's totally Mel Gibson. There's a part halfway through the trailer where a guy looks like Mel Gibson. That's totally him. There's a Mel Gibson cameo. I know. I know there is. And that was him. It looked just like him. As the world fell, each of us in our own way was broken. This looks gorgeous. It was hard to know who Ooh. was more crazy. Me. Or everyone else. <laughs> Guitar shoot flames. Nice. looks beautiful. I can't wait for that. That that can't disappoint. I mean, it, it literally, it can't now. I mean, the three trailers that have been incredible. There's no way in hell that movie's going to disappoint. And if it does, they fucked it up. Now, I I'm I'm going to say it straight up. I'm I'm I have every 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 feeling in my body that that's going to be an amazing film. And George Miller, the guy that created the first three, uh, and they're all great films. I don't care what you say about the third one. I love the third one, but uh, cheesy, sure, but it's fun, uh, a lot of fun. Uh, you can say whatever you want about him. Recently, I think he directed like what Happy Feet and a bunch of other crap. Uh, I know he, he. I'm pretty sure he directed Happy Feet, which I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna hold that against him. But you can say whatever you want. He is a Visionary director, he is. He's a mastermind. I love Mad Max, and even though visionary usually means like, well, nowadays like Zack Snyder, like, oh look all these visuals. Like, no, I, I when I think of visionary, I mean like he knows how to make the visuals itself a character in its own, and that's why I thought Mad Max was perfect for it, because the desolate wasteland of Australia just looked beautiful, but also kind of creepy. Uh, and that looks like it's doing the exact same thing, except obviously way more action, way more of a budget. Uh, I'm really excited for that. That looks amazing. And now we got more of a story, and it looks like we got a, more of a clear villain. And the villain looks like a like a very, very Mad Max-style villain. Like Lord Humongous, um, maybe not the biker gang from the first movie. They were more common but the third one you had uh oh man master blaster and the th second one you had humongous now it's on lord humongous sorry I, I only called him humongous but in this one you, i don't i don't know what his name is but it looks like someone that is clearly in the vein of someone like humongous and uh i'm sorry lord humongous and uh 
Master Blaster. So I'm really, really looking forward to this. It looks great, action, all that stuff. The thing I was trying to say throughout the trailer where I was like, you know what, every time, and then I stopped myself. Every, every trailer I've seen for this Mad Max movie, this is my only criticism, has Mad Max captured. Have you noticed that? Every trailer. Look, watch the other two trailers and watch this one. I mean, you see some a couple glimpses where he's like shooting a gun or struggling with someone, but most of the time, it's him in a cage, him with that freaking Bane mask on and uh, like tied up on the car or something, or him like running from something. It, it, I don't know. Like Mad Max was more of a badass in the other movies. So hopefully they don't make him like just a guy that, you know, maybe saves the day at the at the end but throughout the rest of the movie he's like running and you know scared and he's just like I don't want to do this man I want to get out of here so hopefully so hopefully they don't do that especially with Tom Hardy cuz I think Tom Hardy can easily be an amazing action star and I want to see him in more stuff like this um unless he sucks in this movie who knows the movie's not out yet so I can't really tell you uh but all right I'm going to give this trailer a 9 out of 10 it's a great trailer uh, definitely go check it out. I, I cannot wait for this movie. So anyway, there you go. That's my uh, trailer reaction. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you and goodbye.